In today's video, I drank a quart of Rigidizer. Actually, I didn't even touch this stuff. I put it on my kale wool with a brush. Hey YouTube, what is going on? Uh, let's see, what do we want to do today? I tell you what I want to do. I want to get started with this. This is the forge. Uh, this is the uh, uh, rigidizer for the uh, refractory wool for our little propane forge. And it's kind of late, but I was hoping to get this started because it takes a little bit. It, it's supposed to set, I think, I think it has to set, yeah. Norm, normal curing time is 24 hours, yeah. And it cannot be accelerated by heating. So what I'd like to do is get this started so that it has plenty of time to cure. And uh, so anyway, I wanted to kind of take a poke around on my little forge here and clean up all the loose fibers and then maybe we'll, we'll spread this on and uh, at least get that started. It may not be much, but at least it's something. So, uh, yeah, let's get started. Oh, no. I open it upside down. Now, what this stuff is, is a, um, this is a silica, uh, material that is uh, in a colloidal suspension. I assume it's probably just water. Uh, colloidal being a uh, uh, dispersion in a, in a, you know, where you have one material dispersed in another material and uh, you can't just simply filter it out or whatever. And in this case, I would imagine it's water and what it does is it has to dry. You know, it basically has to evaporate out. Um, uh, let's see, what's it say? Rigidizer is a hardening agent which is applied to ceramic blank fiber blanket to form a protective rigid outer surface of a ceramic fiber blanket. Hence, it enhances lifespan of an insulation. Uh, da, 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 can be applied by brushing, dipping, rolling, and spraying. Uh, can be diluted or used full strength. Really? Interesting. I don't know why you would dilute it. I mean, I know why you would do it, but I don't know. wonder how that affects its effectiveness. It doesn't, I note it doesn't give any instruction on how to dilute it. It just says it can be, so I don't know. Yeah, that's interesting. Uh, normal curing time is 24 hours post-application. Curing cannot be accelerated by heating. So, um, yeah, let's... Uh, Let's open this up. Well, actually, let's, let's uh, make sure my wool is ready first. I don't like there's a gap between these two bricks. And I think what it is is its wool is caught between them. Let's see if I can get something in there and clean that out. Yep, yeah, there it is. It's on this side. All right, that looks good. Uh, I've turned my little uh, forge over on its side to try and keep from getting this on my refractory brick. Not because I'm worried about it doing anything to the brick, it's just that it won't do anything for it, so why pay? You know, why, why? Why put it on there if it doesn't do any good?
All right, there it is. We got the uh, rigidizer on there. I got a little bit on my bricks. I won't hurt anything, but anyway. Uh, the, the purpose of this rigidizer, it, it, it does a few things, but uh, it basically, it kind of it homogenizes, it bonds the, the surface area, the surface of that, um, the, the kale wool, the, the, the refractory wool, and it keeps it, the most important thing is it keeps it from becoming airborne, uh, because basically what it is is, you know, there's a lot of turbulence in there, and it's blowing little fibers into the air, and uh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's an irritant, and you don't want to be breathing it in. So uh, anyway, that's done. That's that takes us one step closer. Now I can go ahead, and uh, I do have enough. If I need to spot, you know, I should be able to, you know, touch up if I need to. And hopefully there's enough to do my doors because I want to line the doors with this uh, this wool. But uh, yeah, that was pretty easy, pretty 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 short little video. And and uh, but it does take us one step closer on the uh, propane forge build. And that's it for this video. So as always, the like, the comments, the subscribe, all that kind of stuff. And until next time, bye. Sim wool rigidizer. Si Simond, store.com sold and marketed by Simmons Store, North Carolina, USA. Made in India. Hmm. Probably not legal to make it anywhere else. <laughs>